Hello, welcome to the channel. Now, who has been watching the new series of Loki? Hands up, hands up in the air. And who watched the first episode more than once? And who's been thinking, actually, it's really good? Okay, so today we are opening a Funko Pop figure of Loki. So we've got him over here spinning around on the turntable in the box. Uh, let's have a little look at the box first. It's your standard pop box. We've got the window in the front. We can see the figure inside. We've got another window on uh, one side of the box. That we can see the figure through as well. And the other side we have artwork of the figure. Uh, or sort of in this case. And then on the back, we have a number of pictures of different pops in this particular series, which seems to be called the Loki series. It says Loki at the top there. And we have got Loki himself, obviously. And it looks like we have got Odin and Heimdall and Lady Sif. So let's take him out of the box and have a look. Let's just turn that off. There we go. Now, this particular Loki, it's not Loki from the new TV show, because I had a look at that, and the only Loki pop from the TV show they seem to have at the moment is Loki sort of wearing a suit and tie. And he looks kind of boring, and he doesn't really look very Loki-ish. So rather than get that, I picked up this one, which is, I believe, Loki from Thor Ragnarok. So, let's have a little look at him. He has got his, uh, well, we can see he's a bobblehead to start with. Yeah, he's bobbling away. And he's got his uh, Loki helmet on with these huge, great curved horns on it. These cow horns, whatever you want to call them. Um, not quite as big as... Uh, they are in the comic, or his original one in the comic. Anyway, this is his kind of movie um, outfit. And then if we come down again, we can see he's got the rest of his movie outfit on, as I'm calling it. Which is kind of black, with green trim, and some little gold highlights. And he's got a long coat on. And underneath the coat, at the front, we can see he's got his... I guess it's his sort of Asgardian tunic, which again is black with green and little gold highlights on it. And then on his arms, or his forearms, he's got what appear to be some sort of uh, metal braces or forearm protectors or guards of some sort. Some sort of armour, it looks like. And then coming down, we can see, we can't see much of his trouser wear. But I'm guessing it's just trousers. And we can see he's got his black boots on as well. And we can see in his right hand he has got a dagger. Which, if you can make it out, has got quite a nicely detailed hilt on it. It looks, it's a bit tricky to see, but it kind of looks like it's either a curved over serpent or dragon's head or maybe a double headed one. Uh, something like that, but something suitably low-key. I'm guessing that's the same as the one he has in the movies. Now, if you look at him, I did say this wasn't quite the same as the picture on the box. If we have a look at the box, and we have a look at the figure, we can see there's some colour difference. Because he has got blue skin here, and on the box he has got his normal uh, sort of pink or flesh coloured skin. Well this is called uh, Loki Frost. I think something like that. This is because he's meant to be half frost giant or part frost giant. So this is him with his blue frost giant skin. Now you may also have noticed on the box there's a little sticker. Well there's two little stickers. One which says um, it is an exclusive but one which also says it glows in the dark. So this is a glow-in-the-dark Loki Funko Pop. Now, 
I'm not sure which bits of him actually glow in the dark. It could be the blue parts. Now obviously it's difficult to tell now how well it does or doesn't glow in the dark. I shall have to find out later on. The best glow in the dark seem to be the one where all the vinyl is glow in the dark. It's glow in the dark vinyl, which means the whole figure is then all one colour. It's all blue or it's all green, whatever. And the other ones, which seem to be painted with glow in the dark paint, don't seem to work quite as well. But as I say, we shall have to have a look later on and see how well it does or doesn't glow in the dark. I'll see if I can get a clip and put up at the end of the video. So that is our Frost Loki Funko Pop from Thor Ragnarok. And that is it for this video. Until next time, remember, hit the thumbs up below and I will see you in the next one.